What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Clockwolf, and we're back with another episode of Kindergarten! I just got finished, uh, editing episode 3, and now I'm back with another episode. I just got done editing it, like, 45 minutes ago, and we're gonna hop right back into this. Ah, cause I really wanna see what else this game has to offer. Okay. Let's take... Two fifty. And let's leave. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Yes. Okay, so this time I want to focus on finding Cindy her dog. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Want to be my boyfriend? Sure. Ha! <laughs> That's what I like to hear. And we'll be totally be the cutest couple in school. But first, you have to do something for me. Is it our love enough? Of course it's not. Okay. Why? And... I'm sold. Where do I do? Okay. Yes. And... What happened to her brother? <clears throat> you haven't heard? He went missing. You haven't heard? He went missing. His disappearance totally stole the thunder from my dog Biscuit going missing. I guess everyone just cares more about him than they do about me. Your dog went missing too? Yeah, I brought her in for show and tell, but the janitor said dogs aren't allowed, so he took her. Apparently she escaped from his closet, and they d can't find her. Maybe I could find your dog. Hmm, interesting proposal. I do miss Biscuit. The question is, do I love Biscuit more than I hate Lily? You love Biscuit more. Hmm, no, I definitely hate Lily more. Oh. Yeah, Lily is actually a despicable person, and her existence bothers me. Don't worry about Biscuit. Just put the gum in her hair during morning time and come talk to me afterward. You got it. Okay, so... I'm still gonna focus on trying to find Biscuit. I, get, I think I got an idea of what I can do to find her. Oh, but I have to buy something from this kid. Buy something... A yo-yo. Deal. Don't need nothing else. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Go inside. Okay, now, all we have to do is go to Jerome. Take this yo-yo. You can have it if you'll be my buddy. You've got a deal, and since we're gonna be friends, I think you should do something to help me out, you know, as a friend. I'm not going to do that, but I am gonna do something. You know that creepy old janitor? He stole my laser pointer this morning, said it was too bright and shiny for his old eyes. I need your help to get it back. Okay, what do I do? When you're ready, I'll give you a hall pass. You're gonna use it to get back by the hall monitor. Once you're past him, head to the janitor's closet. My laser should be in there somewhere. I can do that. Awesome. It should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Got it. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll give you the pass. I won't be able to distract the teacher for long, so head straight for the door. Don't talk to anyone on your way out. Give me a minute. Okay. Now, I got an idea of what we're gonna do. I hope this works. Okay, let's do this. I hope this works. Uh, 
I'm ready. Go distract her. Go, 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 go. Not so fast there, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. Here's my pass. A principal pass. Whoa, yeah, go do whatever you want, man. Sweet. Gonna go in this closet. All right, now I'm gonna go get the note. The uh, note that says that... Uh, can I take all of the things? No, I can't. I'll take the Monster Mon card. Ah, I can't only take one thing. No, I can. I can. Thank God, I can take all. Take the other things. Uh, take the note. I take the note, but I can't read it because I'm in kindergarten. Oh, bummer. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. Before the janitor comes and finds us. Head back to class. Well, did you get it? What? Okay, kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for our nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting! I have a feeling lunch is gonna be very interesting. We'll talk at lunch. Okay. Hey, kid, over here. Well, did you get it? I couldn't get it. Oh man, that's a shame. Looks like I'm gonna have to deal with whatever punishments I get from this. You can keep the pass. I'll see you around. Cool, thanks. All right, now, uh, I got an idea of what we can do. I'm gonna try to get the lunch lady to read the note if I get her her glasses. So we're gonna do that. Let's go to Monty. I figured you'd be seeing me around now. Slop is no good, and I don't think anyone is brave enough to try the biscuit ball from the janitor. Dumb old man can't even spell it right. Never mind. Biscuit ball. Get your biscuit balls here. Get them while they're hot. <clears throat> Monty thinks you're retarded. Okay, let's give her the glasses. Thank you. Uh... What, I can't give her the note? Ah. Sorry, Monty, but you had to take one for the team. Uh, well, shit, there has to be something more I can do with this note. Hang on, let me see what I can do if I get this biscuit balls. Anyway, now that's been taken care of, wanna, wanna buy one of my biscuit balls? What's a biscuit ball? My own recipe came up with it after a little incident that happened recently. What incident? Well, well, you see, that little girl's dog, well, I told her she couldn't have him in school, so I brought him to my closet till her mom could pick her up. Okay. Little thing bit me and as well he escaped. Yeah, he escaped. Are you eating the dog? What? No, nonsense. And the fact that the little girl's doggy's name was Biscuit is just cruel irony. Don't just forget about it. Get away from my stand. Where'd you get the recipe for this? It's a recipe I came up with myself. I have it written down on a piece of paper in a box in my closet. Now if you ain't gonna buy one, skedaddle. Okay, I don't want any. Huh. Okay, so... I think I can do this, but I have to give up the Monstermon card. Shit, I don't want to do that, so... I'm just gonna... 
fast forward. I'm just gonna fast forward this video to the end of the day. Okay, I just finished the day and I got a new Monstermon card, the Sneaky Snake. And I got a new hint. Hey, I made all my money back. Monday again, time seven. This is the Sneaky Snake card. It's so sneaky, we're not even sure this is a picture of it. <laughs> cute. Okay, now I gotta figure out how I got how I look up my hints again. Oh. This is where my hints are. This is the hints page. It will fill out as you play the game. Okay. You don't need any special items to complete the Jerome, Cindy, or the teacher's missions. The lunch lady will let you out of the cafeteria if you give her Monty's glasses or a magnifying glass or two dollars. Okay, hang on. Let me look through some of these things. A few moments later. Okay, so I just got finished reading all these things. It looks like every single person in this game has their own mission. So we're gonna try this again. We're gonna go out and we're gonna try... Nuggets mission. Actually, let's take a little bit more money. Okay, let's go. According to one of the hints, we need, uh, something from Cindy. Yeah, according to one of the hints, we need something from Cindy. Friend, sure. Okay, we got the gum. Now let's talk to Nugget. I hope... We got the gum. Let's talk to Nugget. I hope this is the thing we need. Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Or they would if I had any. Nugget knows no love or friendship since Billy went missing. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? Offering. You must offer something to prove your friendship to Nugget. I only have friendship. Eh? Perhaps that's all Nugget needs. You may have Nugget's Nugget. It signifies our friendship. He gave me an actual chicken nugget. Do not consume the nugget of friendship, for with its digestion, so too is our friendship digested. I won't. Good. Nugget will see you later, friend. Sure. No more talking now. Shoo! Okay. Now, we gotta go buy the yo-yo from Monty. Now, let's, uh, head inside. Okay, now let's talk to Nugget again. Nugget does not wish to spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. What are you busy with? You are curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting. Perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Perhaps. Nugget is in need of a magnifying glass. Do this for Nugget before the next bell rings, and you will be rewarded. Okay, I guess. Hang on, let me uh, talk to Jerome here. All right, now that I got his hall pass, I'm gonna let him distract her, and I'm gonna steal that magnifying glass from the cubby. Okay, ready? Go! 
This is Lily's cubby. There's a magnifying glass in here. She's probably using it to look for clues about her missing brother. Take the magnifying glass. Get over here, kid. Uh-oh. You blew it. No way she's going to put up with another distraction. I'm screwed. Give me my hall pass back. Fine. Good. Now get out of here. You wasted enough of my time today. Sure. I got the magnifying glass, though. Have you found the item Nugget seeks? Yes. Excellent. Nugget is pleased. You may have this Monster Monk card. Mon Nugget is quite fond of it. Thank you. Now be gone. Nugget has more important things to tend to. Sure. Now I'm going to go over to her. Gum. Now I'm going to go over to her. Did you do it? Oh my gosh, you totally did. Wow. What happened? Did she What did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She cried. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy, which also makes you my boyfriend. As my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. I'll meet you over at the dollhouse. I'll be home soon, honey. Can we do anything else with you? Be gone. Nugget does not wish to be bothered. Sure. Okay, let's play, uh, let's play house. Or whatever. Welcome home, husband. I hope work wasn't too hard, because you're going to be making me dinner tonight. Why do I have to make dinner? Because I've been busy maintaining the house, and I... Do I... Have you been drinking again? Wait, what? Don't play dumb with me, mister. Have you been drinking? No, honey, I'm just tired. Oh, sure you are. You're always so tired. I'm sure you won't mind blowing into this then. Fine, I'll take your breathalyzer. I'm completely sober, madam. You, I have nothing to fear. You bet it is. And if you blow so much as a 0 0.01, I'm calling your sponsor. I'll take your test. I am completely sober. Good. Blow. 0 0.32. You're trashed right now. No, it, that's not how that works. How could you do this to me? You said if you would get sober, how can you be a father when you can't even take care of yourself? Be a father? I, well, while you were in prison, it's probably not yours. I'm sorry. I guess I have my own set of problems to deal with. We can work through this. You think so? No, you filthy whore! How dare you? We are so done. No one who calls me that can get be my boyfriend. Get lost. We're not playing anymore? No, you took it way too far. That was too far? Duh. Now get away from me before I get really mad. We're through. But while it lasted. <laughs> Dumb broad. Uh... Eh. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having chocolate cake and cupcakes today. How exciting! Yay, finally, excited about lunch. Now let's go talk to, uh, our buddy Nugget over here. Nugget, no one ever sits with poor Nugget. Nugget does not have any friends. Ah, uh, poor Nugget. <laughs> oh god, I am just the bane in this school's ass right now. I'm not hungry. Uh, I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna...
Okay, kiddos, that's the recess bell. Go burn off all that delicious slop you just ate. Okay, now is Nugget going to do something for me? Wait, let me talk to this guy first. Get out of here! I'm busy! You don't look busy. I am busy! Oh, what's the point? It's no fun being a bully when no matter how many kids you beat up, my dad still isn't coming back. A little bit sentimental there. I miss everything about him, even the way he used to drink excessively. Here, take this thing. A breathalyzer? Aww, it's just like the one my mom used to force my dad to use. Thanks, buddy. Here's a Monstermon card. I really appreciate having this. I'll see you later. No problem. Thanks again for that, kid. I'll see you around. No problem. Behold, the Nugget Cave. It is very deep and very dark. What secrets does it hold? Do you want to find out? No! Trust, trust me, you'll love it! I don't think I will! No one has ever not loved the Nugget Cave! I'm not going, period! Oh, you'll go! One way or another, you'll go! Straight up noping out of that situation! Okay, let me see. Let's buy something. Jesus, that's an expensive card. Okay, screw it. I'm just gonna... I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Is that a chicken nugget? Why are you showing that? It's one of Nugget's nuggets. It means this is one of Nugget's friends. Right! I hope you know what you're getting into! Being Nugget's friend can be challenging! Yeah, I can see that. Anyway, who's next? Someone with something more interesting than a nugget, please! Well, I feel like I didn't really get d much done today, but I got two Monstermon cards, so that's some progress. And I made two girls cry. Progress! <laughs> okay, I got the King Tower Beetle and the Shroom Turtle. And I earned my $10 back. One thing I've noticed in this game is you can't have more than $10 in your piggy bank. Monday again, times eight. This is the King Tower Beetle. This is the King Tower Beetle card. He's just a regular beetle that lives in the King's Tower. I'm reading the card. This is the Shroom Turtle card. It's a guy who ate some shrooms and now thinks he's a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the uh, random adult humor in this, in this cutesy child game. I know this isn't a game for kids, but it sure feels like one. Anyway, I'm just gonna leave this episode here. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video.